This is the pre-calculus ACP study guide for fall 2015. This is problem 16. A police helicopter is monitoring two cars that are 1,500 feet apart. If the angles between the helicopter and the cars are as shown, how close is the helicopter to the nearest car? And what you're looking for is um, you don't see any right angles here at all. And if you don't see a right angle, you're going to try something else, maybe law of sines, law of cosines. Well, in this case, for law of sines, you look for, uh, here you have an angle, side angle. But uh, for law of, of sines, you need a, an angle opposite the side. Well, here, opposite the side, we do not have an angle. But we can construct what that angle is because we know that if the interior angles add up to 180 degrees. Then this angle, I'll call this angle A, where the helicopter is, is going to be equal to 180 degrees minus angle B minus angle C. So minus angle A B is 41 degrees and minus angle C is 29 degrees. And this is going to be the same as uh, 180 minus, let's see, that's minus 70, right? So equals 110 degrees. So this angle A is 110 degrees, which I write in here. And now a law of sines is sine A is over side A is equal to sine of angle B over side B, which is equal to sine of angle C over side C. In this case, we do have A, and we want to find how close is the helicopter to the nearest car. Well, we could figure each of these out. Uh, I'm going to just tell you that if you have a 41 degree angle here at the left, that's going to be a closer car to the helicopter than this 29 degree angle to the right. And the, the thing is drawn somewhat to scale. Be careful about that. But we'll be able to work this all out. Now, what we're going to do is flip this equation. This is kind of the standard law of sines equation. We're going to take, I'm going to change this and make B, side B, which we do not know, over, okay, we're trying to find this this situation here. Except I'm kind of getting it wrong, aren't they? Aren't I? Because we want to find this little side C here, don't we? Because that's opposite angle C. So I want to just change that now. Okay, side side little C is to angle is to the sine of of angle C, which is the same as the ratio of side A is to sine of angle A. Okay, now we've worked that out, let's fill in. So we have C over sine C, which would be sine of 29 degrees, is equal to little a, and little a is 1,500 feet. over the sine of 110 degrees. And so C is going to be equal to 1,500 feet times the sine of 29 degrees. And that's going to be all over the sine of 110 degrees. So going to our calculator, now we made sure that we were in degrees and not radians. Okay, we put 1,500, oops, 1,500 times the sine of 29 degrees over the sine of 110 degrees. And for that we get about so there's foot 774 feet. So we go here and we put C is approximately equal to 774 feet. And we hope that's one of our answers up here. And yes, 
Answer A is very close. So that's problem 16 workout. Look for supplemental problem 16A and 16B for assistance. And thanks for viewing.